Thank you, Kim. Giving driver's licenses to undocumented Rhode Islanders would increase safety in the state. That's according to a new study from Roger Williams University. Shannon Heggie joins us in studio with more on the report, new at 530. Mike and Kelly, the study was done by the School of Law and Latino Policy. It says giving licenses to undocumented immigrants in Rhode Island would lead to safer roads and potentially better economic opportunities. The study's authors found states that provide driver's licenses to undocumented immigrants don't see a massive influx of them, but those states do have fewer traffic fatality rates on average and auto insurance costs are lower. The authors say if Rhode Island were to allow immigrants to have licenses, those applying should be required to provide proof of identity and residence like everyone else. Rhode Island, for example, already requires every single one of us who applies for a driver's license to prove who we are, right? So we have to go to the DMV in Providence, and hopefully you're not going to wait very long, and you're going to submit your social security number or your birth certificate and probably a utility bill for you to be able to prove that you live in Rhode Island. And, and so we want and we should do that um, to uh, the undocumented population if they are going to be applying for um, a driver's license. The study also found that poverty rates decline faster in states that allow undocumented residents to have licenses. The analysis found that there are an estimated 30,000 undocumented immigrants in Rhode Island and that the state has the largest percentage of uninsured drivers in New England. I'm Shannon Heggie, Eyewitness News.